In this session of the Sphere 2 software, we're going to take a look at how to set everything up. So click on the Sphere 2 icon. Once that is launched, this is what you'll see. If you want to take a look at the document camera you have connected, go up to the upper right hand corner and you'll see under Visualizer, as an example, I have the AverVision U10 connected. Now to set it up, go to your left, under where it says Sphere 2, and then we're going to go to Options. Click on Options, and you're going to notice the tabs up above, Image, Video, Text-to-Speech, Auto-Adjust, Tab Cam, and Upload. Now you're going to notice that you're going to have several different options. You can use a suffix, then you're going to have your default file location. This is where the image is going to be saved. Click here if you want to make a new folder in a new location. Also, you notice that you have a file format option. You have JPEG, TIFF, PNG, and bitmaps. If you wish to automatically save your captured images to your file location, be sure and check this box. On the next tab, you have the video. Basically, it will be the same options. It's going to give you the month, date, year, hours, minutes, seconds. Also, for your default location to where you would like to have your video saved. And if you'd like to create a new location, new folder, go ahead and do so. And then you come down to the video quality. If you're going to send it for email, be sure to keep it on low, otherwise you're going to have it on medium or high. Select the microphone, whether or not you have an external microphone or a built-in microphone in your laptop or your computer or your webcam. Now for speech to text, we really won't worry about that too much, but you can go ahead and play around with that if you'd like. In this section, I suggest on leaving everything checked so it is automatic. If you have our TabCam product, that will be connected wirelessly to your desktop. This is where you'll go in and you're going to set up the TabCam. If you click here, it will take you through the various steps of how to set up the TabCam to connect with your Sphere 2 software. Here's just a short example of what you'll see for the setup. If you have an SSID, be sure you put that in correctly, and any type of security, whether it's a WEP, WPA, or WPA2. If you're unsure of the SSID or the type of security, check with your IT department. Now this can be very important if you decide to capture any video with your Sphere 2 software and you would like to upload it immediately to one of the social network sites. What you can do right here is you can link your Facebook as an example to the Sphere 2 software. So once you're done recording, you can go ahead and upload it immediately to Facebook. If you do not put in the link or the password and username at this point, Every time you go to link something or to upload a video, it's going to ask you for your username and password. That concludes this session of the Sphere 2 setup.